In this training module, you will be taken through the operation of a Flix train BR-193 Vectron locomotive. For this introduction, you will be driving the train a short distance and performing passenger operations. To begin, set the master key to on. Set the reverser to forward. This controls the... Open the passenger doors to allow boarding. Close the doors before departure. The train is now ready to depart. Move the throttle into the power range to get moving. Now you've built up some speed, you can return the throttle to the off position to begin. On level grades, you can coast to maintain your speed, reducing energy consumption and stress on the motors. When coasting, always remain vigilant of the gradient, as changes could cause the train to speed up or slow down. Keeping to speed limits is important. If you begin over speeding, apply a small amount of braking force by moving the train brake into the braking range.
are approaching the station. Begin applying a small amount of braking force by moving the train brake into the braking range. Nice job. The train has safely come to a stop. You can now use the passenger door controls to open the doors. Good work. That concludes all of the basics of operating this train. In this introduction, you'll be learning to drive this DBBR193 Vectron locomotive. During this introduction, you will be covering the critical driving controls and freight operations. When you are ready, climb aboard. Sit in the driver's seat. Use the master key to activate the control desk. Set the headlights to indicate that this locomotive is operational. Headlights must be used regardless of the time of day or weather. The direction of travel in a Vectron locomotive is determined by the reverser buttons. Now we can release the brakes and get ready to move. Move the throttle into the power range. Coasting is a method used to efficiently maintain speed and reduce motor stress and maintenance requirements.
come to a stop using the brakes.